Hi Travels out there, it's a brand new week. I hope you guys are all having a lovely Monday and a great start to the new week. I got up early so I could catch up on neighbours and had some cherry jam toast and a cup of tea for my breakfast. And then I was just watching some episodes of Charmed. I then listened to a bit of music, I was listening to a bit of Sabrina Carpenter and did some drawing and coloring in and was watching some vlogs and TikToks and listened to a bit of music and read a bit of one day and had a cup of tea and some biscuits and then I got myself ready to go off for a walk and I went down to my town's castle and got some town's castle autumn photography that I'm going to show you guys. It's so beautiful, I love the gardens, they're so well kept and the water fountain they have there and all the beautiful leaves all over the castle and then I got a snap taken me in front of this pumpkin display they had in front of the entrance to the hotel and I'll show you guys that one of the groundskeepers kindly got the photo of me sat in front of the pumpkin display which is very lovely of them to do so I then went up to the high street and had a look at one of the child shops and went into one of the book shops and then popped to one of the flower shops and got some flower sacks on there. The flowers from there are always so pretty and they always do such lovely bouquets. I then got some plant sacks on there. I love all the plant pots and the cycles of cactuses and all the pretty patterns on the leaves. I then made way home and I got back and I had my lunch. I had some tuna mayonnaise sandwiches with a cup of tea and some biscuits. I was then just reading some more of one day and listened to a bit of music and listened to a bit of Joni Mitchell and had some of my chocolate biscuits that I got the other day, which are so good. And then I was just watching some stuff off record and listening to a bit of Kylie and so I took my pizza doll out and then I watched today's phone away and for my tea I had these cheesy garlic things which were really nice and I'm not off to go and watch today's UK soaps and we'll see you in more to vlog tomorrow. It's now Tuesday. I got up, showered and changed, ready for work. I was doing a 9.30 till 3 and I had my breakfast and listened to a bit of music. I then headed off to work and while on my way to work I got some flower snaps. I had a lovely stroll up to work and it was a lovely crisp morning and it had been raining the night before so the flowers had lots of raindrops on so it might have been raining and made them look even more beautiful i then had a look around some of the child shops just before work and i saw this halloween costume that would be perfect for the halloween bash that i'm having next thursday at jen's as we're having a food and games night like we normally do on Thursday nights, but we're going to have a Halloween themed as the next Thursday it's Halloween, but we aren't going to be able to have the games for food night as we're all busy doing things over Halloween. Like I'm going to a pumpkin patch and Jen's taking her kids to do trick or treating and stuff like that. So we're going to be having a Halloween bash next Thursday before Halloween the week after that, and I then looked around some more of the child shops and was going to get the Halloween outfit but I didn't have time to go back to get it so I hoped and fingers crossed that it would be there after work so I got to work, got clocked in and put my bag and coat away and I'd worn my checkered red flannel jacket to work and this way it looking quite cold it was actually quite mild so I was absolutely roasting and it was just me and one of a colleague on shift and I was doing lots of food and drink cleaning tables doing food and drink orders and bill taking and even did some coffee making and I'm slowly getting there on coffee making and I finished at three clocked off got my bag and 
Co and then head off to go to the charge shop and hoped that it would still be there and luckily it was and I got this pumpkin inflatable outfit that I'm going to be wearing and I can't wait. It needs batteries so I'm going to open this and sort those batteries out and try it on and I cannot wait to show this to them on Thursday next week at the Halloween bath. It's going to be so fun and then I went off to one of the flower shops and I got some flower stats. These flowers have such lovely colours on, lots of orange and yellows and reds. I then got two snaps from out the front of the shop. They had this wheelbarrow with some succulents and other plants in there and also had some autumnal weaves. And I'm gonna show you guys those snaps I got. They're so pretty. I then got myself some lunch from Greg's and got these Halloween themed cupcakes that I'm gonna show you guys a clip of. I got these Halloween themed cupcakes from Craig's. One of them is a ghost, this one's been a bit squashed out. And then there's a spider, a bat, and a pumpkin. They're so cute. I then got changed into my jumper that I'm wearing right now. I went into the bathroom for my workplace and quickly got changed into this and showed my colleagues the pumpkin Halloween outfit. And it's such a good find. And then I went off to one of the plant shops and got some plants that's on there. I love all the plant displays in there and I got a mirror selfie from there surrounded by all these plants that I'm going to show you guys. I then made my way down to my grandma's where my mum was and on the way down there I phoned and chatted to Tash and was chatting to her about the Halloween costume I found and was just having a nice catch up with her and I'm meeting her on Thursday for coffee catch up and then we're going off into Bristol which should be fun and then I got this autumnal snap of these lovely colourful autumn leaves I'll show you guys such pretty leaves with all the orange and yellows I then got to my grandma's and showed my mum and grandma the Halloween costume that I got for the Halloween bash next Thursday at Jen's and I'm so excited to try that on and get that sorted out and have the perfect jumper to put on underneath that and then I had a cup of tea and some biscuits and just had a nice chat with my grandma and then me and my mum got back and I am now off to go and watch today's Home and Away wipe some more of my journal energy for today and then I'm going off to Jigsaw Volunteering this evening and we'll see you when I'm back from that. It's later on in the evening now and I'm back from being at Jigsaw Volunteering. We ended up watching Home Alone. We had a movie night and that was chosen. So we watched that and it's not even been Halloween yet, but it's such a great film and it's got me feeling a tiny little bit festive. And then I got back and I got these shoes ordered and I got two pairs and I'm going to show you guys those. Here are my new pairs of shoes. These ones are my work shoes, my new work shoes. They're leather which means they will last longer and they look really nice with this pattern on. I just got to sort the laces out. And then these ones, again I've got to sort the laces out. These are my everyday shoes. I should actually know I think these are going to be for my best and my old work shoes are going to be my everyday shoes and yeah I really like these new pairs of shoes. I just hope they don't wet my feet too badly. It's always like that when you get a new pair of shoes it takes a while for you to get used to them so hopefully they shouldn't. I had this one pair of shoes where they just wet my feet so badly that I like wore them like once or twice maybe and then ended up having to get rid of them so hopefully it's not the case with these two new pairs of shoes. I then had a fry up tea. The fry up tea was so good and then me, my mum and dad are watching a bit of Gavin and Stacey and I'm so excited for the Christmas special coming out this Christmas and I'm now off to go and watch today's Home and Away 
and the UK soaps and also have Bake Off and What Road to Watch and I'm going to be finishing writing my journal for today and I'll see you in more vlog tomorrow. It's now Wednesday, I hope you guys are all having a lovely day. I got up after a very long line as I had been up in the night and I then had some toast and a cup of tea for my breakfast. I was just watching a little bit of TV and listening to a bit of music. I just was drawing and colouring in. I was watching some vlogs and TikToks and some funny dog and cat videos. And I was going to go for a little walk, but the weather has been so crap. It's just been lashing down and so gloomy. And it's the type of weather where it's so gloomy that it just makes you really tired and sleepy. So I've just been doing lots of drawing and reading some more of one day and listening to some music and listening to a bit of Kylie and her new album comes out soon which is very exciting and had a cup of tea and some biscuits and I think there's no better way to spend a rainy gloomy day than with a cup of tea, a book and lots of biscuits to dunk in your tea. So I've just been doing lots of reading this afternoon and then I had some soft cheese rolls with a cup of tea for my lunch and I was just watching some episodes of Merlin, I've gone back into watching that again and I was supposed to work tonight doing a five talk pose but one of my colleagues needed some more hours so I gave her my Wednesday evening so I now have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday off and I'm back in Saturday daytime and tomorrow me and Tasha are off into town which should be nice as there's a clothes shop that she likes going to that is closed down so she's gonna hopefully get some bits from there and then just have a look around some of the shops in Bristol, go to Cabot. I haven't been into Bristol shopping for a while so I'm looking forward to having a little mutual while I'm there and then I was just doing some new illustrations and colouring some videos in and for my tea I had a cheese and potato pie and I'm going to show you guys that. The cheese and potato pie was so delicious. I then was just working on some illustrations and colouring some videos in and listened to a bit of music and was just watching some vlogs and reading some more of one day and then I was just watching some episodes of Doctor Who and watched today's Home and Away and I'm now off to go and watch today's UK soaps and we'll see you with more of the vlog tomorrow. It's now Thursday and I got up ready to go off and meet Tash for a coffee catch up and then we were going to be heading off into Cribs and then into Cabot in Bristol. So I got myself ready for that and had some toast in the company for my breakfast and just watched a bit of TV and sort out my blue top doll into a new look just before heading off to go meet Tash. I'm gonna show you guys. Here's my blue top doll's new look. She's got her black boots on. I love these shoes on her with the buckles. Then she's got the black netting stockings and she has this blue and red dress. I love this bit here with the black collar and the black belt and then this blue bit and then this red bit here with all these pretty patterns all over it. Then she's got this big black leather jacket on and she's got a black hat and that is the whole look. She is stunning. I then put her away and got myself ready to go off and meet Tash for the coffee catch up and my mum had gone to take my grandma for a doctor's appointment and my dad was fishing like he does most Thursdays and the others were at work and younger sister was just watching a bit of TV. I then locked up and headed off and had my headphones on and listened to a bit of music on the walk up to meet Tash and then we went off to one of the coffee shops and I had a white chocolate hot chocolate with this rainbow frosted cupcake that I'm going to show you guys. Whilst we were there we booked the flights for our trip to Edinburgh next month so excited for that and it's not all paid for so we can now just relax and count down the days for then i am so excited to go off to edinburgh around christmas time it's going to be so beautiful then we head off to go get the bus into the mall and we got to the mall and had a look around some of the shops and i got some pop figures from mankind and we also got some donuts from Krispy cream and they were ghostbusters themed and i'm going to show you guys a clip of those here are the Krispy Kreme donuts I got. They are Ghostbusters themed. This one has the Ghostbusters logo. This one has Slimer the ghost on. And then this one is just chocolate sprinkles. And then this one has orange on with some sprinkles on with lots of Halloween colors on. And they are so cute. Cannot wait to tuck into those. We also got some bubble tea. 
absolutely love bubble tea. It's so good. I had a mango and passion fruit tea with some blueberry bubbles. And then we headed off to Smith's and I got the two OMG LOL surprise dolls that I've been wanting to get for ages. And whilst in there looking around, it played One Direction, which broke my heart with the devastating news that Liam Payne from One Direction has sadly passed away. My thought and prayers go out to his family and friends at this horrible time. It's just so devastating. And then me and Tash headed off to go get the bus into Cabot and we got there and had a look some more of the shops and went off to Damage Society and got some stuff from there and also went off to one of these vintage shops with lots of cool clothes and mirrors and things like that in sadly closing down so I had a look in there just before it was closing down and then we went off to McDonald's and had our lunch the McDonald's was so delicious. I had a Big Mac meal and I love a Big Mac and also had a hot apple pie and a vanilla milkshake and stayed in there for a bit. And then we went off and had a look around some of the shops and I got a photo of this Wallace and Gromit mural and I'm gonna show you guys. Can't be a bit of Wallace and Gromit. I'm so excited for the new Wallace and Gromit film to be out soon. Definitely gonna be going to see that. And then Tash got a photo for you. It's a bit of the mural with this rainbow. We then made our way to the bus stop to get the bus back and we then got the bus back and Tash got off at Audi because she lives near to there and I got the bus at the very last bus stop so I just listened to some music and just chilled and it'd been quite a busy day. I'm surprised I didn't fall asleep and then I got back and I am going to show you guys a clip of some of the things that I got whilst out today. Here's a few things that I got from the Mao and Cabot whilst out with Tash today. Starting off with these two pop figures I got from Mankind. I got an Emily and Victor pop figure. I love Tim Burton's Corpse Bride. It's probably one of my favourite Tim Burton films. Such great animation. And Victor comes with his dog Scraps, which is so cute. And then I went off to Smith's and got these two OMG LOL surprise dolls. They're sisters. This one is a gamer and she has this headset with cat ears on and this really cool outfit on and I love the eye makeup and then she comes with some accessories that I'm going to open up for you guys later on and on the side it says her name she is called Ace and on the back it just has a photo of her and her sister it's Ace and Puella and then here is Puella and she's in a very Harajuku style dress with lots of patterns on and I love her hair as well. And she comes with some accessories. And I'm gonna open those two for you guys in a bit. And then I got this notebook from Damage Society, which is one of Tasha's favorite shops. And it's a notebook and I'm in my witchy hour. And I love this notebook with all the spells, like potions and stuff on and crystals and candles and witches hats. And then I also got this little pin that says, Big Witch Energy, and I love that. I'm gonna put that on my jacket later on. And we went into Urban Outfitter and saw one of our colleagues who had a chat with them. And I got these socks, which are so soft. And I love the pattern on those. And then got a photo with loads of snaps. And I'm gonna cut one of these out to give the Tash. And that is what I got today whilst I was out with Tash. I had a great time out. I'm now going to open these two dolls for you guys and show you guys them out of box. Here are my OMG LOL dolls out of box, starting off with this one. This one's just a gamer, I'm going to show you guys her first. So she's got this headset on with cat ears on and a little microphone. I love the eyelashes and the eyeshadow, it's giving me Triggy 60s vibes and this awesome outfit with lots of colours on and I love the jacket, it's very futuristic with the zipper through the middle and the pockets and she's got her knee pads and her socks and her water skates and she is so pretty i love the aesthetics all the purples and pinks and then she came with some accessories and some shoes and they came in these boxes which are so cute and on the side it says the shoe size and inside it came with 
the stuff wrapped up in these lovely little bits of paper and she comes with some sunglasses a hair clip and a stand and then this hairbrush and then this awesome handbag that says game over and it looks like a game boy i love that and then onto this one here again her things came in these adorable little boxes like boutique bags it looks like they've been shopping i was wrapped up in these adorable bits of paper and this one is a gamer and this one is mermaid inspired and i love her face and if you can see she, it might not show up but her face actually has glitter on it and i love her makeup and her earrings and her shell necklace and her jacket and her skirt with the pearl belt on and it's very cutesy lots of waffles lots of sparkles and glitter and she's got these frilly socks on and these adorable wedges with lots of pearls on she's the queen of the ocean and i love her hair with the blonde and purple bits in and the ponytails and she comes with these glasses that have hearts and their pearls and then with this little pearl purse which is a bit of a handful to open so i'm just gonna leave it like that and those are my new mg lol dolls are so pretty i put these in my dollhouse had to move a few things about and rearrange a few things but they are fitting in perfectly where i've placed them and put some of the newer dolls on display and some of the older dolls into storage and i'm now off to go to the food and games night at jen's and we'll see you when i'm back from that I'm back from being at games night. I had such a lovely evening. We played some games, we played some card games and also played some games on Dean's PlayStation. And we had some baguettes with some chicken and stuffing in, which was so delicious. And had some cheesecake that David had made with Biscoff on. And I'm gonna show you guys that. The food was so delicious. We then played some more games and then I walked back with Dean, who just lives on the corner, and I am now off to go and finish today's journal entry and then watch today's Hill and Away and UK Soaps and then have new RuPaul's Drag Race to watch and we'll see you tomorrow at the vlog tomorrow. It's now Friday. I hope you guys are all having a lovely end to your week, almost a weekend. I didn't have morning group this morning like I normally do, so I got a bit of a line, which is good. I then got up and had some cereal for my breakfast. I was just watching a bit of TV and was watching Merlin. I love that show so much. And just listened to a bit of music and doing some drawing and coming in. I watched some vlogs and TikToks. And I was going to be going to the garden centre with Tash, but she was busy. And so we decided to do it another day. And so I just went off on a massive walk and was enjoying the lovely sunshine and blue skies. And I got some flowers that I'm going to show you guys. I was able to get some really pretty flower snaps whilst on my walk and also got a pretty autumnal leaf snap. They're so pretty with all the pretty colours on. I love all the orange and yellow and red leaves. I then got a selfie and photo of those leaves and then on the way back I bumped into one of my colleagues so I was having a nice chat with them. I then got home and for my lunch I had some tuna mayo sandwiches with a cup of tea and also had one of my Ghostbuster donuts that I got from Krispy Kreme for the mail with Tash the other day and it was so delicious. I had the one that had slime on and it had like green lime custard in the middle which was so good and then I was listening to a bit of music and there was some drawing and coming in and just watching some episodes of Doctor Who and sort up my office and my dolls and dollhouse and also sort up my Peter doll and then I sorted out my pin on my denim jacket and I'm going to show you guys a clip of that. Here's a new addition to my denim jacket pins. I've got this pin that says Big Witch Energy from Damage Society and it's got a crystal in the middle and a moon and some plants and stars it's so cool and here's the rest of them it's coming on nicely with lots of different pins i love that pin i'm in my witchy hour at the moment 
I then listened to a bit of music and did some drawing and colouring in and wrote some of my journal entry for the day. And for my tea, I had some pizza. I then got my uniform ready for work tomorrow and I'm now off to go and watch today's Home Away and UK Soaps and finish writing my journal. I will see you in more of the vlog tomorrow. It's now Saturday. I hope you guys are all having a lovely start to your weekend. I got up early and had a shave and got showered and changed, ready for work. Had some breakfast and was listening to a bit of music and just watching a bit of TV before work. Then my dad brought me to work and I got myself a drink from the corner shop and was early. So just before work, I popped to the flower shop and got some flower snacks. They've got such lovely colours on. I was chatting with the flower shop keeper in there. I also got a stamp of their window display themed for autumn with lots of lovely pumpkins. I then got to work, got clocked in and put my bag away. And it was me and three other colleagues on shift. It was pretty busy and I was doing lots of food and drinks, clean tables and doing some food and drink order and bill taking and so on chatting to some of the workers. We had a great team on and some great music playing. So I caught myself having a bit of a Bob while cleaning tables and cleaning tables outside as well as inside as we have people sitting outside and the weather wasn't too bad today and so I had lots of people outside as well as inside and I was getting dog bowls for dogs to have water in and some of the dogs that we had in were so cute and I then finished it free and I clocked off and got changed to my jumper that I'm wearing now and I had some pancakes with a hot chocolate and I'm show you guys that. I had banana and cream pancakes and had lots of whipped cream on my pancakes, which I loved. And the hot chocolate was made by Tash and it had an old chocolate heart in it, which is very cute. After that, I then went off and had a look at one of the child shops and went off to one of the pubs and had a drink there and got a photo sat on the sofa area. I love that sofa area, it's so comfortable with the wooden panelling behind me and the pillows. I then stayed in there for a bit and saw my grandma's neighbours and their kid who was growing so fast, that baby. And so I was chatting with them and then I was chatting with Tom, my family friend who works there, who had just come in for a shift. And then I headed off and had a look on some more of the shops. I went to this little craft shop and got this little sewing, or hanging, it says bloom on and I'm going to show you guys a clip of that. I got this little hanging sewn bit of artwork to put up on my wall. It's so cute. It says bloom and then has all these lovely sewn flowers and I love the colours and patterns on these and all the little pretty petals and I just love things like this. I can't wait to hang that up. It's so adorable. After that I then went off for a little stroll and I got some flowers that stuff. I had a really nice walk back from being at work and was able to get some really nice flowers that's with lovely colours and patterns on and then went back I got my uniform ready for work the next day as I'm doing a split shift I'm doing 11 to 3 5 top clothes and then I was writing a bit of my journal, just a bit of music and just some drawing and colouring in and such up my boots at doll and was reading some more off one day and had a cup of tea and some biscuits and it's now a bit later on in the evening so I put my little light on and got my autumnal lights by my mirror on so it's nice and cosy and for my tea I had some burgers that I'm going to show you guys. The burgers were so delicious. I'm now off to go and finish writing my journal entry for today and then I'm going to be watching tonight's Strictly Come Dancing. I hope you guys all have a lovely evening and all have a lovely day tomorrow and I will see you in more of the vlog then. It's now Sunday. I hope you guys are all having a lovely Sunday rest. I got up ready for work. I was doing an 11 till 3 5 job clothes on a split shift. So I got a little bit of a lion which is nice. I then had some breakfast and got showered and changed and was watching a little bit of TV just before work. And then my dad dropped me to work. I got to work, got clocked in and put my bag away. And it was me and three other colleagues on shift. 
and it was pretty busy so i was doing lots of food and drink orders and cleaning tables and so on to some of the regulars and was wearing so much food and drink and doing all the cleaning jobs as well and the weather wasn't very nice so it got quite busy due to that and then towards the end of my shift the sun came out and it became quite nice and so we had more people come in after we had a bit of a quiet bit so i was able to get those tables cleaned that need to be cleaned and then i finished at three clocked off got changed to the jumper that i'm in now love this jumper one of my charge shop finds love a charge shop find and then i headed off and got myself a gregs for my lunch i love those bacon and cheese turnovers and had a vanilla slice with the apple juice i love greg's apple juice and i had that in there so i sat at one of the tables and enjoyed that and then let my food go down and then i headed home and on the way back i got a beautiful flower snap let me show you guys such lovely colors on those flowers i then bumped into my boss and his wife and kids who were off on a lovely sunday stroll and he's in kitchen tonight so I said about how I'd been on split shift and he was like, see you tonight. I then got back and my headphones had got jammed a button to turn them on and off. And my mum tried to help fix them. And I was gonna wait for my dad to get back from watching my older sister play rugby for him to sort it out. And then the on off button has literally just come off of the headphones. So they are currently broken, I'm hoping that my dad can fix it otherwise i'm gonna have to get some new ones which is very annoying and then i sorted my bluetooth doll into a new look let me show you guys here's my bluetooth doll's new look starting off with the shoes she's got these daisy shoes on with these laces and then she has these blue denim jeans then she has this waffled long sleeved frilly jumper with lots of flowers and leaves all over it it's very autumnal i love the pale yellow vibe it's very like autumnal and then she has her hat on and she has her joker necklace on and some dangly bits of hair either side and that is the whole look giving full vibes absolutely love the autumnal look that she's in i then wrote a bit of my journal pissed a bit of music and did some drawing coloring in and my mum brought my grandma over for our Sunday roast. My mum's just been getting ready and it's not so good. And I'm having mine when I get back from work this evening. I'm doing a five till close and I'm then off for five and a half days. And then next Saturday, I was going to be working an evening shift, but now I'm doing nine till five instead. So I'm working a day shift, which means I get the evening off and don't have to work state night, which I hate working. And I am not off to go and have a cup of tea and some biscuits and read a bit more of one day and just chill before going off back to work this evening and we'll see you with more of work when i'm back i'm back from being at work the second part of my split shift went really well i got back to work got clocked in and put my bag away and it was just me and one other colleague to start with and i was doing lots of the cleaning and close jobs that needs to be done and so I chatted to some of the regulars and was running food and drink and clean tables and doing some food and drink orders and drinks making and we had quite a lot of bookings in at like five six which was quite busy and it was really busy until like seven ish and then crashing down and then at eight o'clock we had the quiz so lots of the regulars for the quiz came in so that made it even busier and so i was serving lots of drinks putting lots of pints cleaning lots of tables and then i closed with one of my colleagues and one of our colleagues had come in and done seven till ten and then i finished at like 11 ish and got picked up got back got to my pajamas and for my tea i had my sunday roast i'm show you guys Sunday roast was so delicious. I then had some sticky toffee pudding for my afters and I finished writing my journal entry for today and I'm not off to go and watch the Strictly results. I hope you guys have all had a lovely week and weekend and all have a fab new week ahead. Please like, comment and subscribe and I shall see you with a new vlog coming very soon.